Details at this hour on the murder investigation that now has six local people in jail. Now here are the uh, five mugshots we received from Mays County. The sixth suspect is in custody, but at a hospital in Arkansas. Prosecutors say the group is tied to the illegal sale of prescription drugs, which led to a woman's death last fall and prior. New at 5, Fox 23 Sarah Whaley talked with the suspects as they were arrested. The teen who found his mother dead of a drug overdose in this prior home is now one of six people charged in her murder. Police say that not everyone involved in this case knows one another, but detectives can prove that each had a part in the woman's death thanks to these text messages. We got a warrant for your arrest. A huge operation in Mays County. Keep your hands up. You step out. To get six accused killers off the street. Did you give your mom pills that killed her? Aaron McNulty wouldn't say a word as Captain James Williard arrested him. Detectives say the teen gave his mother, Jennifer McNulty, the oxycodone that killed her. And they tell me that evidence shows he got the prescription drugs from a long line of illegal dealers. Mike Myers is one of those suspects. You have a warrant for your arrest, okay? Uh, conspiracy to distribute narcotics and murder in the first degree. Since when? Officers had to kick in his door to get a hold of him. I'm not part of it. I had nothing to do with it. But prosecutors say Oklahoma law says Myers did have a part because he introduced other suspects in the drug ring to one another. How do you feel to have a first degree murder charge? How the you think I feel. With the help of nine agencies, police also got Jennifer McCormick, Andrea Gregoire, and Christina Dempsey arrested Wednesday, and Vito Favusa is being detained in an Arkansas hospital. This is a over 10 month long investigation with hundreds of man hours. All of it a combined effort to send a big message. Police say if you're dealing drugs, you're taking a big risk because if someone dies, <laughs> these guys are coming after you. Prosecutors here are really cracking down on prescription drug abuse. I found out that they will soon launch an initiative to target these crimes. In Mays County, covering news that matters, Sarah Whaley, Fox 23 News. New